Heather, where are you? I think I need a hand. Can you come pick me up? I don't know where I am, but I can tell it's not where I want to be. Oh, brother, help me out. Keep your eye on me. Don't let me go somewhere. I can't find my way back. No, don't let me go. FXT have sent us out a, a new camera system to try out. I haven't tried this before, but we've actually had it for a wee while, but we just never got making a video on it yet. But we had put it on our lorry trailer, so it had got wild abuse on the back of it with the salt in the roads and stuff splashing up on it. But as you can see, it has lasted really, really well. The lens on it and the lights, the night vision lights, LEDs are uh, spotless so really really rugged so it clearly shows that uh, it's very well waterproof and watertight for rough conditions but we we'll won't stick it on our cabbage harvester here we've got uh, it already has a camera on it but we we'll actually haven't used it yet because um, the harvester came with cameras on it but the leads and all are broken on it and everything like that and it's just not worth trying to get working so I'm going to put this new system in, just wired to uh, 12 volts um, on the harvester so you just turn the side lights on, you don't need to plug any extra wires in and the screen's wirelessly sent back, we'll get that put in, into the cab because the, the back of the harvester is very very hard to see um, you can, can't see it anywhere from the cab so we'll have to, uh, the cameras needed to be able to get the boxes onto the harvester so uh, we'll get it installed here I'd already put a magnet mount on it from the our uh, lorry when we had it on it so I'm just transferring it over you can just stick it down in the bottom here beside this existing camera but it's no use so we'll get rid of it 
wireless is far easier to use. You can stick it there and it'll be able to see the forks uh, for picking up the boxes. And uh, see with the LED lights compared to these here cameras, the lens is separate from the lights. Whereas here the LEDs are connected with the lens, so when it goes to the night vision, uh, the, if there's any dirt on the lens, it actually will start and dazzle with the camera. So you actually, in the night vision, is very very poor on these type of cameras. But with these new systems, with the uh, lens separate, the night vision is unreal. And the amount of LEDs there, you get perfect. It's like daylight when you're looking at night vision with these hair cameras so brilliant piece of kit and uh, also they come with a DVR feature so you can take this panel off the back of the screen and put a SD card into it and it'll allow uh, you to record onto it so if you're using it on the back of a lorry or something it can be technically a dash cam for something went wrong so uh, we'll get it installed the 12 volt lead on this or well it can do multiple voltages um, it has a USB lead on it as well which is very handy because it'll allow you to charge your phone you're not using the socket up for just the screen so we'll get it installed and see how it works so we've got the camera wired in here it's uh, just down at the back on the pallet forks and it's just wired in the side lights so the camera switches off with the side lights, you just turn the side lights on, which you normally would have on anyway. So we moved the camera about to try and find the good angle on it and tilt it at the where it needs. So now I want to operate the controls. You can clearly see what's going on behind. Whereas when you look over there and I'm moving, you cannot see nothing. So definitely brilliant job so make it far easier for picking up boxes